Today, I have the pleasure of speaking with eResearch's Chris Thompson. How are you today, Chris? I'm great, Tracy. How about you? Chris, we've been following how you've been following Movely Media. You initially put out a buy recommendation and then an update. So let's mm-hmm. start there. What's your update price on Movely Media? Our update price target is it's a buy rating with a 75 cent price target. Well, considering that it's trading what? 13 cents, 14 cents. There's a lot yeah. of uptick there. Um, can you tell me why you think there was no response to the market action after that, what I deemed to be a significant piece of news on Lee Enterprise? Yeah, I, I think that Moodly is looking to uh, need some support with uh, revenue numbers that should be coming out uh, in the next month or so. The year end was September. Um, and so I think that they're looking for you know, the market is looking for some revenue support. In, in the, the report that I wrote originally, um, you know, this Lee Enterprise uh, type of deal are the deals that we thought that Movely would be reporting on uh, and, and the basis of their, of their revenue generation. So for those of you out there that are not familiar with who Lee Enterprises are, Chris, can you tell us who that company is and why this is such a significant news, uh, piece of news for Movely Media? Yeah, Lee Enterprises is listed on the NASDAQ. The ticker is LEE, and it's a it's a fairly it's a large company. You know, its a market cap is is 180 million dollars, 800 million dollars of revenue. So this is a big deal. Uh, they are a marketing automation platform. So they allow companies to come in and do marketing automation like SEO, etc. And they are embedding the Movely video product within that product. So this is where these deals where you have thousands of users who will be paying you know, Movely a fee to use the, their um, services each month. And of course, you and I both know, because we've got a lot of experience in the markets, that Lee Enterprises even allowing Movely Media to use their name in a news release in itself is a milestone for Movely Media. Yeah, so this is where you have a, a, a much larger company allowing the cross-branding. And this is where we believe that, you know, uh, the team at Demovely has spent their time to create integration points that allows companies like these large uh, marketing and technology companies to integrate with it, with the Movely product within because of the, the work that the team has done to create a, a platform that companies can then integrate into their solutions. And I think one of the challenges in my humble perspective is that Movely Media is one of those companies where investors out there are going crypto clean tech, ESG, but what should they be typing in? Media, I think they're more of a media, a platform, software, uh, cloud platform technology. How would you describe Movely Media to our audience? Yeah, I think it's a, it's a new media technology company and, and it's a platform that uh, for the larger enterprises who want to have a full service uh, video technology platform that they can integrate within their services um, and, and allow uh, their users to have this technology. We all know that video is the mainstream right now, growing on the internet. Uh, everyone is getting into video because that's how they're getting their message across to their users. And I think that the, when you're looking at Movely, it's not so much a video application platform as it is a technology platform that allows these larger companies to integrate these types of video services within their product lines. So Chris, you know, it's always fun to have you on Investor Intel to ask questions that I would like the answer to. So video technology, where are we going with it? Well, I think if you, anyone who has kids or anyone who spends time on the internet these days, um, you know, video is making the majority of the, of the uh, flow on the internet. And so I think these tools are only gonna grow over the next little while as video becomes, a, it becomes more mainstream. So if someone wants to read the Movely Media e-research report or the updated report, how do they get a hold of it, Chris? You can go on to eresearch.com and look on company reports and select on Movely, and you will see both the initiation re- report that we wrote a couple of months ago, as well as the recent update report. And for those of you out there in Investor Intel, they're wondering how they can also follow both Investor Intel, eResearch, and Movely Media. All of our Twitter accounts will be listed below. Thank you for joining us today, Chris. Thank you, Tracy.